Friends, today we're going to talk about sharing and collaborating with Tinkercad in 2024. So let's get cracking. I'm going to mention three different ways that you can share and collaborate. The first way is simply by adding the tag HLMT23 to your projects when you make them public. You can see we have many awesome designers that are using this. It is a fantastic way for me to see your cool projects and give them a reaction. That is a fantastic design. Don't forget, you can also click view in 3D. After a moment, the project loads. You can zoom in and check it out from every angle. What a fantastic creation for the joints and sockets challenge. Of course, just like I check out the awesome projects and give them reactions, you can as well. They are so darn fantastic. You can use this as inspiration or you can just open them up and be amazed at what was created. This one created by Speedy takes a little bit longer to load, but after a moment, you are able to check that out from every angle. And Speedy Designs, that is absolutely amazing. All right, so tagging is the first way that you can share and making designs public. The second way is collaborating. Right now, I'm going to go to my designs and I'm going to create a brand new 3D design. It is going to be a super simple chair. As you can see, I've added legs. I'm cruising this one out on top. I'm going to make it so it fits. So it's super fast, but I'm just showing you how we could collaborate on something. And after just a moment, simple chair. And the second way I can share this is to click over here on the collaborate button. When I generate a link and copy that link, I can now send it to another user. So you can see here I have composed an email that's going to another of my accounts. And when I hit send, that user will get an email and you'll notice here it has a word called share code. If you try and just copy this, they don't work. But if you've got the share code, the user can click on it and you will both be in the design. This is one of the coolest ways that you can collaborate. Check this out. I'm going to hit the note tool and I'm going to just say simply, hey, cool project. And look over here in the other design, it showed up. So you can work together as a collaboration. When users are stuck on projects, you'll often see me say, send me a share link, reach out at HLModTech Gmail, and I'll see if I can give you a hand. So that is the second way that you can share a Tinkercad project. And let's go to the third way that you can share projects. When you finish your design, if you click back on the Tinkercad dashboard, you can click on that design and you can change its properties so the whole world can see it. So of course, make sure the design fits. Mine is going to be how to share and collaborate in 2024. I will have a tutorial up here. Of course, I also have a link to the new HLMT23 tag and other ways that you can reach me. This is where you add tags. I've got HLMT23. I'll add share, collab, and collaborate. And then you've got to check the privacy. Initially, even though you add all this, the design is private. If you switch and make it public, the whole world can see it. You'll have to confirm you're not a robot. I'm going to share also the other share trick, which is called the share link. This is fantastic for teachers. If you want to send a template to all your students, this is the style that you can choose. It's not publicly listed, but all your students can work on it just like you'd expect. I'm going to go back to the public, though, because I want the whole world to see it. Of course, I've got to prove I'm not a robot. And then you need to pick your license. If you do share alike, the whole world can modify it. There are different versions of that down here. If you don't want the world to modify your design, then you've got to choose no derivatives. I don't care about my chair, so I'm going to let people modify it. And I'm finally going to hit Save Changes. Now this design is totally public and the entire world will be able to check it out. As I wrap up, I do want to highlight a couple more of the cool designs that I saw on the HLMT23 tag. We've got a fantastic automaton arm created by Lucas Is Me. And then also I saw this sweet SP Morale, a fantastic jet created by Speed Dude Performance. Not only does it look cool, check it out. It has got a missile with a smoke trail. That's fantastic. And finally, we've got an El Camino created by the Tin Mangler. 
That's awesome. As we wrap up, don't forget the three ways you can share. Of course, you can tag it with HLMT23. I'll check it out. Hopefully, everybody else is visiting this page and checking it out as well. You can also use the fantastic collaborate button so you can create a link and share it with users so you can all work together on the very same project. And then finally, you can use that sweet share link option so you've got a link that you share only with the users that you want to. All fantastic ways for you to work together using Tinkercad. Of course, have a glorious day and keep tinkering. Friends, as I wrap up, I do want to take a moment to remind you about my website, hlmodtech.com. I do have a page dedicated to Tinkercad with tons of awesome categories. Below that, you'll find the day one favorites, the useful starters, and the Tinkercad essentials. If you scroll down below there, you will find my class, Tinkercad in 20 Days. It is hosted on cadclass.org. This video explains everything, but I do want to highlight at the bottom is a coupon code 25HL Tinkercad. It'll get you 25% off any class at cadclass.org. You can visit that site by simply clicking visit now. I do also want to highlight this sweet built-in messaging tool. You can click that button, add your question, comment, or suggestion, and reach me almost instantly. Finally, friends, if you enjoyed the video, please give it a like. Please also hit that share button so more people can learn about HL Mod Tech. Of course, friends, you absolutely make my day if you take time to leave a comment down below. And if you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button. And last but not least, hit that notification bell if you're going to be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.